Is it legal for a store manager to lock their employees in a store and tell them no one is leaving until all the work is complete, even though the shift has ended? Someone wrote, this happened to me at Ross years ago. The store closed at 9 on a Sunday night. The manager was informed there would be a visit from corporate the next morning, so everything needed to be cleaned. After closing, most employees needed to leave because they rode the bus and couldn't miss the last bus of the night. Others had different excuses why they couldn't stay to clean. I felt bad for the manager and stayed to help him clean the store. When 11 came, I told him I needed to go because I needed to be at my main job at 8 a.m. He said, I need to stay because I drive a car. That is not right, just because I drive. He locked the door and wouldn't let me out. I kept cleaning at 3 a.m. I told him if he doesn't open this door to let me out, I was going to call the police. He then opened the door and told me I was fired for leaving without permission. I told the store manager the next day and he was suspended. Good for you. Now let's see what people in the comment section have to say. Tim says, no matter what, an employee cannot lock you in the store or prevent you from leaving. Call the police next time. Joe says, yeah, called false imprisonment. It's kidnapping if you get moved to another location. Steve says, I think in some states it's still kidnapping without the need to move someone. Michelle says, kidnapping is taking of a person against their will. Note that the definition includes taking. False imprisonment is the unlawful violation of a personal liberties of another. One can be guilty of both if kidnapping results in holding someone against their will after the taking. Wow, that's very interesting. I do feel like employers are getting beside themselves a little bit. I feel like they take advantage of the smaller people or the people below them, and I don't think it's right. And then people want to complain that people don't want to work. <laughs> well, this is another reason why. You take advantage of the people that do work, the people that do go above and beyond their jobs. Just saying. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below.